Hang on, I'll be with you shortly there. Hang on. We're uh, still in the garage, but the door's open. And I got my uh, John Deere hat on. That means uh, it's going to soon be <laughs> agricultural time. <laughs> uh, today, what we're going to talk about, talk, and uh, it's more or less of a show and tell. There's a viewer in there, a young man. He comes from the UK. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I, I must say I like his videos. He's a well-spoken young man. And uh, I kind of gave a comment that his tractor was the little brother, I think I said, of mine. Because <laughs> his is a nine horsepower and uh, he's about to, uh, I think, rebuild it. Uh, ring job, uh, valve job, uh, head gasket, uh, more or less try to... Uh, take out the oil consumption out of it and uh, he, he said uh, what kind of wheel horse do you have well uh, first uh, uh, question is right but uh, just I must say partially because I know specifically that wheel horse was wasn't part of Toro here in North America in the, I don't know, I'll go back maybe 20 years or so, maybe more. Uh, and uh, now, Dave, hang on. We're going to take you for a little walk. And we're going to talk at the same time here. Uh, we're going <laughs> to, yeah, the wheel horse wasn't part of uh, Toro a long time ago and uh, wheel horse were known to have uh, dependable tractors see this here it's uh i said it was a 520e it's a 520 hydro hydro for hydrostatic right under there there's a hydrostatic pump the pump is a eaton pump and uh that's what powers the drivetrain here and the lift there's a little arm on this side here Ooh, I don't know it's kind of dark eh? <laughs> right right there there's a little arm and it powers a lifting cylinder and that's good for the back Ooh, I have the wheel weights on mine cement wheel weights that used to be covered with black plastic and written Toro on it like the one on the far side. Right now, the seat is kind of a storage. I got two elevator weights. Oh, by the way, I have a, a lens for that light that I bought. <laughs> two elevator weights at the back. That helps me in the winter time. And, uh, okay, <laughs> snow blower. Because that's, that's the use of this machine. The snowblower, or if you had the uh, lawnmower, I have the mower, okay? It's quick attach, you see right under there? Mower just clips in there, and I don't know, there's arms at the back. I never really looked at it too much because uh, I don't use it for cutting grass. There's a drive for the snowblower is right there. There's a clutch affair that's shifted. And where's that arm? Right there. There's an arm. There's an arm. The, okay. This, see, it says wheel horse. Wheel horse. But this, hang on. It's a Toro wheel horse. So I don't know in the UK. If they had Toro wheel horse, I don't know if that existed. Hydro. Uh, the motor in there is a 20 horsepower own an engine. They had the, I've been reading a little bit, they had a bit of a flaw, those engines. Supposedly the, the valve seats 
would uh, there's just uh, like an insert in the block 